Hello everyone, we are going to solve problem 106 of chapter 4. The forces F1 and F2 act on the end of the beam. Replace these forces by an equivalent force and couple moment acting at point O. So we are going to replace our beam with a beam that only has resultant force and a moment or a couple moment at point O. So for our beams to be equivalent, the summation of forces in each beam should be the same and also summation of moment. So FR, the resultant force should be the same as summation of forces, which in this case is F1 plus F2. And the problem could not make our job easier because the forces are given in Cartesian form and in Cartesian each component is a scalar, so we could simply add them together. Negative 4 plus 3 would be negative 1, and so forth. So the result would be negative 1i plus or negative 2j, negative 5k, and the unit is killing it. So we are done with our resultant force. Our job is to find the resultant moment. So summation of moment will give us the resultant moment. Summation of moment, we are in 3D, so moment is R cross F. Because we have two forces, then we have two position vector and two uh, force vectors. So position vector would be from O to this point I call this R O one and another position vector to this point. I call this R O two. So we have R O one cross F plus position vector from O to point two cross F two. If you look at the image, you can find a position vector from O to one. O is a origin so the coordinate is zero 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 so we only need to find a coordinate of point uh one which is four i minus point one five j plus point two five k same thing r o two would be four i plus j point two five k and the units are in meter. So I found the position vector. Here I connected one to two and then the other way around. So let me correct the naming. From origin to force two, so that would be RO2 and then that would be RO1. So now that I have the position vectors, I have the force vectors. So MR would be simply summation of moment or addition of the cross products, I, J, K. Because I have two cross products, so I have two determinant to find. So it would be four, negative 0.15, 0.25, negative 4 to negative 3. Here the second row would be our position vector 4.15, 0 0.25. So basically I'm writing here, bringing this to this row and bringing this position vector to this row. And the third row would be my fourth vector, 3 negative 4, negative 2. And if we uh, find a value, I'm going to write it here. So our moment would be 0.65 i plus 19.75 j negative 9.05 k. And the unit system that we have is kilonewton meter. So our answers is this moment
and this resultant force. We can replace this beam with this FR and this MR and the two beam would be equivalent. 